Good afternoon. Uh, today I come to you uh, with some thoughts on my mind to share. It's not exactly where I wanted to go with this channel, but I think I'm going to have to live up to my moniker here a bit. I'm coming to you today with a bit of a chip on my shoulder that's kind of been building up and getting bolder. Behind me, if you'll take a look and see, I'm at a old state owned shooting range that was within just walking distance of me. But as arbiters of our own sport, we haven't been the best support. So I think it's fair at this point to give you a little bit of background. Uh, a little over a week ago, I showed you probably the prettiest smooth bore I've ever owned. And I say that as a guy that used to build them for myself. I went out to now the replacement range for this place, drove 20 miles to find it locked up. And it kind of put me in a bad place because the reasons we don't have things like this today in this state, and yes, this state, my home is in the Rockies about 1,400 miles from there, that way to the place of my birth. So now I'm stuck in what I'm going to just basically say the land of Gretchen, what, 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 and I'll let you fill in the blanks. <laughs> we are at our own fault for things like this. One, not following simple rules like don't shoot between past these hours. If we bring it in and use it, clean it up. And we could come down here one day, shoot, and there would be a television sitting in here all shot up. Clean that up a couple days later, there'd be pallets and stuff. We have got to start holding ourselves accountable. Now that's only one of the rants that I want to get into, but it's time for me to explain. We have to be the ultimate in what we believe in and be better than they are. I think you get my point. It's kind of a sore point, especially when you get to doing what I'm asking to do is to get to the best point of is too much, too much. And I need a nice white bed like this to help me figure that out. Now I'm gonna now come to a point where I'm gonna go on to subject two. And that is, I'm gonna just punch up a little bit at much bigger platforms and shooters than me. And that is, why are we so smart about the First and Second Amendment, and yet we totally forget about the rest? And when I mean say that is, I have a problem between the right to and what is basically shooting ourselves in our own foot. Now, I'm a big fan of the Second Amendment, and I'll fight for your right to do it no matter what it is, but there comes a point where we should just shut up. Case in point, let's take the fart and remove the A and figure out that that's what it does. It doesn't do anything special other than have a little extra oomph. So I don't think we need to prove to our enemies the ability to run off 10,000 rounds without a hitch in our reliability. Or a piece of plastic that's nothing more than plastic, piece of crap as far as I'm concerned. But should we be sitting there going like this in the air and leaving evidence for, our, for those who are seeking to find a reason? There comes a point where we're responsible for our own accountability. And just because we can say it doesn't necessarily mean we should. If you disagree with me, why don't we all get together, get drunk, go to the same alcoholic check-in point, and all together in unison say, you want me to do what? Well, hell, I can't do that even when I'm sober. It makes as much common sense as standing there giving ourselves away in fodder to an enemy that's looking to take it away. So, with that in mind, I'm going to live up to it, say, and remind you that if you came in here with your sleeve, feelings on your sleeve, 
looking to get butt hurt, you may have come to the right place. I'm Gawa. <laughs>